Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Prince Automation Destination. This is Prince. So today we are going to talk about another important interview question related to API automation, wherein we are going to cover how to upload a file to an endpoint using Postman first, then we will discuss the same using the REST assured. So without further delay, let me jump on to the practical demonstration. In your case, the endpoint will be provided by the application side, but in my case, I have set it up locally. So using Node.js, so this is the location where I have created this particular server. Now I am going to up this server, which is out of scope, because in your case, the input endpoint will be available and will it will be up. As I am using Node, so Node index.js, using this, what will happen is, this server will start listening at localhost colon 3000 and now what is the endpoint so the endpoint is this one right http colon localhost colon 3000 upload right now let us try to upload a uh, file to this particular endpoint right so what i'm going to do i'm going to open postman then i'm going to click on new to add the new request i clicked on http then I'm going to click on post and now I'm going to provide the endpoint after providing the endpoint as we are going to upload something so we would need some body and in body I'm going to select form data and if you will see after clicking on form data it is populating key and value by default it is expecting us to provide text but in our case we want to provide file so let us select as a file now you need to provide the file name in my case i kept it file but this will be provided by the endpoint what is the file name they are expecting then we need to select the file right so what i am going to do i am going to select this particular file before that i want to show you that this is the location where we are uploading the file so so far there is no uh, any file so as soon as i will upload the file to this particular endpoint so that file will be stored at this particular location so let us observe the same so let me click on send so you will observe that file uploaded successfully and if i'll go inside this particular uploads folder so file has been added now right so this is how we can upload right now uh, if i will see the log let me open the log of this particular uh, endpoint that we have hit so this is the latest endpoint that we have hit so if i'll expand you will see in the request headers that content type is multi-part slash form data so when we will try to upload the file using postman it will automatically select multi-part slash form data so the same thing we will be using in the rest assured okay so without further delay let me jump on to the practical demonstration using rest assured so I have already created one Maven project where I have added one REST assured dependency. I have created one class upload file to endpoint. Here now what we are going to do first we are going to hit the endpoint. So to hit the endpoint in REST assured this is the syntax. REST assured dot given dot first of all we need to provide multi part right or content type sorry content type is going to be multi-part so content type dot multi-part so we have selected this then we are going to provide multi-part and in this multi-part we need to provide the file name and the file okay so this is the file name that we have provided in postman as a key now we need to provide file so what i am going to do i am going to point to the file so file file equal to new file and here I'm going to use paths.get and I'm going to import this particular package first. So I have imported it, right? Next thing is I have already pointed or I have already copied the path of the file which we want to upload. So let me provide the same in this particular get section. After that, what we need to do, we need to convert this into URI, okay? Because this is what this particular endpoint expects, okay? So what is the error so let me provide this particular slashes yeah so this is provided now the next thing is we need to provide file also what we need to provide we need to provide media type as well right in postman it is intelligent enough but in this case we need to provide media type so media type is image and apart from it it is jpg 
right so i have kept this particular restriction while uploading the endpoint right um, now the next thing is dot when dot post right now we are going to provide endpoint right so this is the endpoint and let me provide this particular endpoint and then after what we need to use dot then dot extract dot response dot status code we can verify and it is going to be 200 right status code dot we can say status code is enough i mean and then after what we can do is we can capture the response in response object right response response let me import this particular response file once we have got this so let us capture the uh, response only then what we will do we will simply print this particular status code so first what we will do we will print the response as a string also what we will do as out response dot status code right so this particular response dot as string should show file uploaded successfully and this one should show the status code which would be 200 so let me run this particular program So you see that file uploaded successfully and uh, status code is 200 and if i'll go to this uploads folder i will see second file so it was uploaded earlier five minutes ago now this one is uploaded right so this is how we can upload it using uh, rest assured okay now if for example we remove this particular image slash jpg what will happen so let us see the same so this time we should get a status code error status code which is 400 i have kept during development of the endpoint only images image files are allowed and 400 and if you will go to this particular uploads folder there won't be new file which will be uploaded so this is how we can upload a file to a particular endpoint so the main point is we need to use content type as a multi-part and then in multi-part section we need to provide the file and uh, file as a key so in, in your case it could be uh, some other name as well that will be provided by the api team itself then we need to provide the location of file and then we need to provide the media type which was image right in my case but it could be pdf it could be text right and it could be anything right so this is how we can upload a file to a particular endpoint and this is what i want you to cover as part of current video thank you for watching i would request you to please like share and subscribe thank you once again